Hello, hello, welcome to 5.0 robotics machining video. This video is mostly for people who love robotics, are new to this, or maybe already know what all this is about, or maybe you just fell into rabbit hole from YouTube or something. Anyways, today we're going to make this out from this and many more. Before we start, first things first, safety precautions. Uh, I need glasses. <laughs> okay, we got the glasses. Always uh, have the uh, table clean and also keep the safe distance. My name is Rauno and today I have a challenge to make very important parts for this machine. This part is called walnut housing. What exactly it does is it connects to the tower and to the ball screw. There goes in uh, ball nuts and this is ball screw. So basically when this moves, it also moves this part, which is attached to this tower, which also makes the tower move. So basically it's a very important part for the uh, X axis movement. So as you can see from the reflection of the light, it has very beautiful and clean surface finish by that machine in the process and also threads, very accurate threads straight from the process. So in today's video, we're going to use aluminum series seven and six different tools and I'm gonna talk about them later on. If we have loaded up the file, we can press the start and see how the machine works. leveled out the material so we have the zero everything is very leveled up <laughs> and uh, the next part basically is roughing which takes away most of the material that we do not need and the strategy for that we're going to use is uh, dynamic milling a professional machiner but I'm not concerned about that because I have Smartbox. Smartbox is a program that gives back feedback about uh, technical data like vibrations, splinter RPM and watt usage and thanks to that innovative solution we can always be sure about how far can we push the machine and that everything is correct in the process and yeah so far everything seems to be okay so let's continue So, as you can see, machine did a very nice job over here. I changed up the tool. The next one is 5mm drill, which is going to uh, drill holes for the threads. So yeah, basically this is the next step. And let's see how machine does the job. So here we see that the machine has drilled the holes, very nice holes for the dreads. So next thing is dreading and uh, I have already mounted the next tool for dreading. So yeah, let's go. that holes have been dreaded. For example, if I take and I try to screw it in, 
So as you can see, it goes down effortlessly and uh, 20 holes in three minutes. Uh, no human error, everything is uh, precise, straight down, 90 degrees. Yeah, everything works, everything is fantastic. Okay guys, so we're almost finished, just the roughing of this uh, last metal and I have already mounted it on the table and yeah, let's fire it up. So this is the finished product. Now we just have to remove it uh, from the plate. And as you can see, very beautiful, shiny, like a mirror basically. Even fingerprints get sticked on here. <laughs> and yeah, very precise job, very, very quickly done job, beautiful. So let's remove the plate. And voila, here we have the finished product, amazing. Before, we were buying these parts for 42 euros each. Now I can make four parts in two hours and I can operate more than one machine at the same time. Thank you everyone for joining us on this video. I hope you liked it. Join us on the next one. Subscribe, like, look at our uh, website, anything. Just uh, see you on the next video. Ciao.